box from Sears. This is part of that same shipment, the stuff that I ordered from Kmart, Kmart Sears Connection. Okay. They sent me a bag of air. I hate this. The clothes, they don't need to be buffered against the box. I actually really like it when companies send them in the bags. Except the boxes are recyclable and the plastic bags are. Anyway, regardless, this, I hate this. I don't need it. Okay. First up, a basic red turtleneck. Not very exciting, I know, but not everything you own can be exciting. You have to have some basics. If you didn't have blue jeans or white t-shirts, you know, you wouldn't be able to build things around them. And this turtleneck serves a real basic function for me. I live in Texas. It's not cold enough in the winter most of the time to merit buying a whole winter wardrobe. So if I buy something like this turtleneck, I can take some of my dresses and things and I can put it underneath of them and I'll get the little pop of red at the neck and I'll maybe get um, some red at the sleeves and it'll take some of my summer things and turn them into winter appropriate uh, garments. So it's a basic piece. If it fits, it has to be pretty tight since I'm planning on wearing none of things. If it fits well, um, I'll keep it even though it's not super exciting. Okay. <clears throat> they sent the hanger. Actually, I'm glad they sent the hanger because we have a shortage of hangers in the house. Okay, bright blue uh, pinstripe. Just a blouse. It's got three quarter sleeves. Again, not very exciting, but I'm desperate for clothes like this. This is a workhorse in uh, my kind of office environment. You know, again, I'm a lawyer, it's a conservative office. Button up blouses, perfect. Pinstripes, perfect. The blue, I like, so I can jazz up some of my clothes. Um, I can wear it with my suit. It's exactly what I need. If it fits, it stays. Okay, time for the last package that I'm gonna show you tonight. Um, there's the one I'm not gonna show you, and then there are several that haven't come from the mail yet, and I'll show you those later. This baby is from Lane Bryant, and it really came in this box. Uh, I don't know how they got it closed, but let's go. There's gonna be a lot of black clothing in here, which is gonna be hard for you to see very well, I think. I bought a lot of dresses from them. Okay. First up. Basic. Uh, is it called Ponty? Uh, Ponty? Pont? I don't know. Knit dress. A little bit of a drape front. Cheap felt. I, I swap it out for my own. It's longer than my knees. Um, this is the kind of dress that I was talking about that I could potentially put the red turtleneck underneath of uh, to make it more winter appropriate. This is my cat bow. <laughs> um, I have been eyeballing this dress and several of the others that are going to come out of this box ever since they came out. So I'm really excited that I got them all on clearance. Alright cat, get out of the way. <laughs> I love you, but you have to go. Yeah, I might have just pushed my cat off the table. <laughs> He's fine. Okay. Another dress. This one has a cowl neck. Um, feels like it might be a little thicker. Same cheap belt. In fact, the exact same cheap belt. I thought this was a little bit more brown online than the black and white that it appears to be, but I still like it. So we'll see how those fit. Like I said, a lot of blacks coming out of here. My recent shopping binge has really been more about getting basics into my wardrobe. Okay, 
These are the wide, wide leg pants. Look, that's half, but look how wide that is. And it's got a um, cuff hem. I was in Lane Bryant today, so I know that the size is the right size. Speaking of which, I think Lane Bryant has done some vanity sizing because I'm wearing the same size that I wore a year ago and I'm heavier. And the clothes that I have from a year ago that are Lane Bryant that are this size don't fit. I think they're expanding. Okay. I'm excited about these. They should have some flair around the office. another dress. It's the same fabric. It's a variation on a theme here. Oh, this is actually the exact same dress as that pattern dress, but in gray. Cowl neck. Longer than the knee. Good for work, blah, blah, blah. one of the skirts that I thought might be a contender um, along with that grow grain ribbon skirt it's black it's um, like a brocade a little bit shiny a little bit dressier it's got a nice satin waistband this feels really nice and it's lined oh thank you Lord I'm excited. I may be taking back what I was saying earlier about that girl green ribbon skirt from Avenue. Hey, look at the dress. <laughs> it's the same fabric. It's also sleeveless like all of them. This one has a little bit of beading up at the neckline. And if I remember, it's a little shorter. This one was also less expensive. I probably won't keep all of those. I'll probably I'm picking one of the black ones to keep. But again, I'll look at the receipt and see. The good thing about the Lane Bryant stuff is that um, if I don't like it, I can take it to the store and return it. Um, which I can't do with the Avenue stuff anymore. You used to be able to and you can't. I hate that. Okay. I don't even know what to, how to describe this fabric. It's... um. My neighbor's dogs are barking. Okay, it's heavy. It's not satin, but it's it, it almost feels like a heavy satin, but that's not quite as shiny as satin. Uh, short sleeve, shirt dress, got buttons up the front. I'm excited that it's different from the other ones. And um, if this fits, I think this will be great. As you can see, it's short sleeved. And like I said, when I tried on that blue dress, short sleeves are pretty rare in dresses. So as long as it doesn't make me look like I'm a candy striper or I'm in a nursing uniform, I like that. A little bit of modesty around the office, but it doesn't make me hot. I have been really into the big, giant, fluffy, belted sweaters this winter. Um, this one actually is not too thick, which is nice. You can, actually, you can see my hand through it, so it won't be as oppressively hot as some of the other ones I have. But um, our house is cold. It's pier and beam, so the floors have cold air underneath of them. And my feet are always cold, and it's nice to just snuggle up with a sweater. I'm excited about that. Same thing in black. I'll leave that one in the package just in case. I think I bought this cardigan that I'm getting ready to open in a different color at Lane Bryant today. This is the problem with shopping too much all at once, is that I bought a bunch of stuff online and then I also went into the store and bought a bunch of stuff. Ooh, this is a really thin sweater. Like the white parts, I can see my flesh tone through them. I'm not sure how I feel about that. 
Texas heat, it's kind of nice. It means I could probably wear it in the summer. But this to me just doesn't mean quality as much. It does feel nice though. I'll try it on and see how it goes. Have you seen there's been not one stitch of color in here? DKNY jeans. I like the fact that the color is different from any other jeans I have. I'm not expecting them to fit. I have a really hard time with jeans. Um, I mean, I think everybody does, but uh, I don't know. I, I have a really hard time with them, so I'm not expecting them to fit, but I'm hopeful. And I like how they look. One last thing, the only bit of color to come out of the Lane Bryant bag. Check out that bad boy. Oh yes, that will look nice. I'm very excited. Well, it's gonna take me a long time to try all those on. <laughs> so, uh, that's it. Okay. I went ahead and put on the red turtleneck under the first black um, Lane Bryant dress, even though I probably wouldn't actually wear this combination together. First thought. Um, the turtleneck's a little too big. It's not slim fitting enough. And I'm not sure if it's a refined enough sweatshirt, uh, <laughs> refined enough material to pull this off. Okay. The dress. Do you know how I mentioned the vanity sizing? Do you see this? This dress is huge on me. Um, and I did not, I did not order the wrong size. Um, I checked. I ordered the size that I actually thought was a little bit optimistic and that it was probably going to be too small, but you know, y'all are going to lose weight. Um, <laughs> so, I'm probably not going to show you all the rest of the dresses because they're all the same size, they're all the same fabric, and I'm pretty sure they're all the same cut, just with um, different necklines and things. Um, I could probably get away with this one layered, but I couldn't wear this sleeveless. I mean, you could see my my bra, you could, shit, you could probably see my feet now all the way through the whole dress. Anyway, so I'm really disappointed. On the upside, it's going to save me a lot of money if I send it all back. I'll try on a couple other things. I stand corrected. Um, the dresses are dresses that span two size ranges, like a 14, 16, 18, 20. I thought I was going to need a bigger size because I put on weight, but like I said when I went to Lane Bryant today, their sizes doesn't seem to be the case. So I actually ordered the size I thought I would need, which since it was a two size thing, was the size I thought I might need and one size bigger, way too big. This is a size smaller. I like how it fits. I'm hoping <laughs> that more of those dresses over there are this size and not the bigger size. I'm very excited about it. is a little bit higher than I like. The mandarin collar is not usually very flattering on me. I'm worried it's a little matronly. Might be better with my own belt. I don't know. I'm going to try it on some things out of my wardrobe and we'll see. Because I am very partial to the fact that it has the short sleeves. Okay. A couple different things going on here in the necklace. It's a good length for me. I like it. The sweater. Um, it's nothing special to look at. I love it. It feels amazing on. And I think it's one of those pieces that you're not too excited to purchase, you know. It serves a function, but you wear it to death. I'm pretty sure I'll really wear this and the black one all winter long. So, let's take this off and talk about the skirt. I like the skirt. It's lined. Um, it feels like it fits really well. I'll have to look at the video. Here's the problem. When I was tucking in and trying to 
get things to lay smooth. I realized I can't pull the skirt up. I haven't tried to sit down yet. <laughs> so I'll do that next. But I know that what that means is, and this might be too much information, but it means I can't go to the bathroom without taking the skirt down. That does not sound like fun in the workplace, which is where I plan on wearing the skirt. So I'm going to think about this one. Let's give it a spin. We'll see. All right, I'm being brave. I've got the jeans on in front of you. Um, I really love the legs. They're a good length for heels. Um, they feel really good in the legs. They're good in the tush. The only problem is, they give me a little bit of muffin top. I don't think a tailor can fix that. Uh, a little bit of weight loss could fix that. But um, we'll see. Again, I'm going to look and see how much they were. I think they were kind of expensive, though. I think they might have been like 90 bucks. If they were, they go back. If they were less, I'll keep them, probably. Okay, the sweater. Eh. I'm not super jazzed about it. Um, I like it. It feels good. It feels really good on. Um, the pattern I like. It's nice. It doesn't jump out at me. But I don't really have very much pattern in my wardrobe right now, and I think this will really mix in well. So I think it's one of those things that um, will work well rather than the individual piece just grabbing me and making me excited. So I think it's a good purchase. One last set of things to try on and then we're done. Okay, here we are, the last two pieces. I have on the Lane Bryant wide leg pants. Wide, look at that. Um, and this Worthington dress shirt. The pants, love them. They fit really well, they fit in the waistband and in the hips, which is amazing. The wide legs are fun, makes them a little bit different. Um, they're a summer weight pant. They're very thin, um, but they feel like a nice quality. And they're not lined. And I'm telling you all that because somebody wanted me to review them. <laughs> the shirt, the shirt's too big. Um, I would like it to fit more like that, but if it's like that. And I can't just take it in and have it tailored because it's too big here, which is really hard to fix. So um, that's the problem with buying things that will fit les boobs, is they're too big everywhere else. I think I'm going to get some shirts custom made. That's my thoughts. Okay, thank you very much for coming with me as I open up my packages and uh, try everything on. If you stuck with me, I'm really impressed. Have a good one.